At the time of recording this video, I have now owned and used the Sony FX6 for exactly nine months. And there are just so many amazing things about this camera that I love that I already talked about here on this channel. But I think for this video, I just want to share with you guys how it's been taking this camera on all these jobs I've been getting for the past nine months with using this camera. So first things first, if you're new to the channel and you don't already know, I am a camera owner and operator of a Sony FX6. Now, before I bought this camera, some of you might know, some of you probably don't know, but I was looking for a new cinema camera, a new camera as a whole. I used to own a Blackmagic and a Sony a7S III, and I wanted to leave that lineup and hop into more of the cinema world. Even though the Blackmagic is a cinema camera, I just didn't like that cinema camera. So I had three options, either the Canon C70, the Sony FX6, or the Red Komodo. Canon C70 was already a big scratch out because I sold all of my Canon glass and I didn't want to reinvest into Canon glass. So that kind of was a no-go off rip. So that left me with two reasonable options, either the Red Komodo or the Sony FX6. Both cost the same price, but both are technically two different cameras. With the Red Komodo, I loved the image that it was able to produce. And with the FX6, I also loved the image that it was able to produce. But at the time for me, I just really didn't care about that because I knew the FX6 and the Komodo both looked amazing. I cared more about the features. I wanted something that was going to work perfectly with my workflow and just make my life so much easier. And with the features compared from the FX6 to the Red Komodo, the FX6 won for me. It's just the little things that the FX6 has that the Red Komodo didn't have that just helped me on my deciding purchase whether i wanted to buy one of those cameras between full-size xlr between built-in nd filters the features like picture catch recording and all this fun stuff and the easeability of how to use this and sony's updated color science and the workflow for this it's just it's amazing all in all after the nine months of using this camera it just been fantastic i have got so many different types of jobs i have learned so much from operating this camera i have got into places and events and conferences and honestly making that decision for me to invest into my gear and myself essentially is what really got me to where I'm at in my career right now. And though this is a fantastic camera and I love it, I still by all means don't have any physical attachment to this camera. Who knows, I might get rid of it in two or three months from now. Just because I'm boasting so much on how I love this camera doesn't mean I won't be quick to get rid of it. At the end of the day, it's just a tool that's just making my life a little bit easier right now. And who knows, there might be a different tool in two, three months that might make my life even more easier. Buying the FX6, honestly, in a way, I felt like helped my YouTube channel. It helped to grow my audience because before having the FX6, I was struggling trying to be consistent with these YouTube videos. I was struggling trying to put out videos that you guys would like. And ever since I bought the FX6 and I started making videos about the FX6, I was able to generate an authentic audience through this camera. Some of you may have found me through my FX6. Some of you may have found me back when I had the black magic, but this camera has helped boost not only my freelance career, but like I said, my YouTube career as well. And that's really cool because that shows that a lot of creators and a lot of other filmmakers out there are really interested in this camera because if no one was interested in it, then no one will be watching my videos about it. So all in all, that's pretty much my nine month review on this camera. One thing I do want to say is I personally want to thank you all for watching my videos, especially the ones who've been here since the very beginning and the ones who maybe joined during my FX6 videos. I really appreciate you all. And next year, I'm super excited for this YouTube channel is going to grow and be. I'm super excited for my freelance career. And I'm super excited with meeting a lot of different faces. Without further ado, I'm going to catch you next year. I'll be on to fun journey.